afternoon folks welcome back thanks for joining me again it's um, been a while um, it's been a funny old summer this year uh, there's a lot going on um, and also the weather has pretty much put the kibosh and all fly fishing down here in my little corner of the UK um, so I haven't been getting out much at all but uh, things are starting to change now I'm starting to get my mind back around uh, a bit of trout fishing so I thought I'd share a little, uh, little pattern with you that's going to be working over the next couple of months on all your reservoirs and uh, small waters, a little booby pattern um, and it's um, for the Daphnia feeders, you're going to get uh, Daphnia feeders starting on the big lakes as everything cools off and at the back end of the season the Daphnia tends to be green so this is a little olive blob booby, very very simple to tie very very quick and yet very very effective in clear water, I like using it so um, let's get stuck into it, hooking the vice uh, is a talon hook and this is the WG020 barbless it's a nice wide gape hook not too heavy and perfect for boobies booby blob boobies those sort of things um, it's spot on for what I want this for on here I've already tied on um, and shaped uh, some formula eyes on there okay you can see my other video I'll put a link into it up there of how to do that uh, thread is just an ato black Okay, nothing special, just eight toe black. So we'll just get that thread onto the hook and uh, we'll get tying. As I say, super quick tie this one. Um, as always, if you like the videos and enjoy this, please click like, click subscribe. I'm going to try and get stuff out more regular again now. Some fishing videos as well to come um, now that the weather's breaking. I'm able to get out a bit more. Okay, this blob booby has got a little tail to it and I normally don't put a tail on the blob booby but I find this quite effective on the olive blob booby and we're on a little bit of black marabou okay it's just normal black marabou feather take a little pinch of that uh, not too big you don't want to, it's not a massive tail it's more a suggestion just adds a little bit of movement to the fly okay so I'm going to take a little pinch of that uh, black marabou and uh, just trim off the rubbish bit at the end there offer it up to the hook always start at the top to give you a nice even profile and just work backwards with that all the way down lovely up and down to secure everything there we go and what I'm going to do is I'm going to pinch this off fairly nice and short as I say I don't want a big tail at all on this this is just going to show through the fritz the fritz I'm going to be using for this is a new one from um, Uphaven Fly Fishing um, it was sent out to me as a, a little tester uh, a few months ago and I loved it started tying up some blue flash damsels and bits and pieces and it's the camo it's the camo olive um, it's a nice look on the right end of it it's a nice mixture it's got a light and dark olive running through that lovely to work with nice and soft and you can pack plenty of this on the hook without impeding the hook point um, yeah really impressed with this and i know i'm going to be using this a lot over the autumn time so ben's just released this and uh well worth a look into this is the camo the 15 mil camo okay um so we we'll just tie that in take that in in there just tie that in at the back here nice and tight bring the thread back up the hook so it couldn't be an easier flight tight it's a great one especially if you're starting out you want to practice a few little flies this is a nice one to go with and we're just going to so angle those that hackle backwards and then we're going to start to palm it up the body and nice touching turns all the way up and you can see how you can get plenty of this on because it's lovely and soft and then the water it takes on a really nice color and it's not too vivid but this is absolutely perfect and uh definitely going to work for those daphnia feeders as i say i'm going to start targeting those soon there'll be all columns of the water um and it's well worth having a go they're not coming to the normal orange stuff you know and your comps as well if they send a lot of orange we're worth thinking outside the box a little bit a little olive blob booby or even a black blob booby something like that can work wonders i can get plenty of that in there see that really packs down it's lovely material really nice really impressed with this stuff um you're gonna find plenty of uses for this so i'm just gonna bring that up there and catch it in couple of turns there right behind the head right behind the eyes and then just make sure nothing's trapped in front of the thread couple of wraps behind the eyes bring it forward and then I'm just going to whip finish super simple super effective bring it off there whip finish there trim that off trim this off nice and close just like so what an easy fly 
and yet that is going to work wonders as a point fly uh, nice compact little killer that is and we'll certainly be giving those a swim might even give them a swim at Blagden and Chew this weekend um, sounds like everything's worth a go there at the moment uh, thanks again folks um, thanks for watching the video and please stay tuned for uh, more regular videos again I'm going to get them back on top of all this again but uh, thanks again click like click subscribe any suggestions anything in particular you'd like to see tied please leave the comments down in the comments box and I'll get back to you as soon as I can thanks very much again bye bye